Well, hello again. Source Codex here. This is an update on my earlier how to get a spacer off of the axle of an old wheelbarrow. Well, I was successful as you saw in the last video. And if you noticed, I had a pretty beat up, rusty looking wheelbarrow. Well, the new tire is on, the spacer is on, I made these countersunk things because the old pieces of wood were ratty, seeing as the wheelbarrow is anywhere between 38, 30 years old. So, I think things look pretty good. I bought a new one of these uh, wheel protectors where you flip the wheelbarrow up on. And in just a few minutes, we'll take a look at how she looks right side up. Well, there she is. My 38 maybe 30 year old Tralfa wheelbarrow made in Norway and I think she looks pretty good ready to go ready to get back in action again a little bit of paint a little bit of sanding new handles new wheel some new wood here and there a new uh, wheel brace uh, front protector there new nuts and bolts and as you can see I'll show you here up close you can see the uh, the pitting that the rust did over time in this old wheelbarrow but it's got a lot of life left in it okay if anybody has any questions curious of some little tricks I used I will tell you about one trick I used real quick. You notice the carriage bolts in the wheelbarrow? Well, how do you hold those in place when you've got the wheelbarrow upside down and you're attaching the brand new wedge, the handles, the uh, foot here? the wheels and all that good stuff how do you keep the carriage bolts in place pretty simple good old duct tape I duct taped all the heads of the carriage bolts down turn the wheelbarrow over and there were the bolts sticking up easy to access and I didn't need a third hand to hold them um, I did the same thing here to keep this in place before I marked and drilled holes. I just held the front brace on with duct tape and it worked just fine. So, this is Source Codex signing off and saying, don't throw away your good old wheelbarrow. Put a little love and time into it and you'll have a nice cute six cubic foot wheelbarrow just like this for next to nothing compared to the crap they sell now. A good wheelbarrow like this is going to run you, if you get a professional grade, it can run you easy $200 to $300 don't pay that just fix your wheelbarrow up yourself 
it is not that hard. Oh, I probably got six hours in this and probably about two or three hours of running around and getting the tire blowed up like I talked about in the last video. But here it is, completely finished. And I will end the video showing you the before picture of what this looked like. Ciao. Happy landscaping.